An SUV slammed into the rear end of a school bus as the bus was running its morning route. The driver of the SUV, 54-year-old Helen Dean of Sardinia, was pronounced dead at the scene. Oh, no, there was no braking. We didn't hear any kind of, you know, screech of brakes. We just heard, you know, the, the collision. Keith Marler lives nearby. He ran outside to help in the moments after the crash, but there was little that could be done for the woman driving that SUV. State troopers say the vehicle didn't break. It apparently didn't have any lights on at the time of the crash, even though it was before sunrise. I just had a flashlight kind of slowing traffic down because there was no lights you know, other than the bus and you couldn't really see the bus behind the vehicle coming from that direction. The school bus was carrying students for White Oak Junior and Senior High School, and they were really just about a mile from their destination when this accident occurred. Three students were taken from the scene to the hospital to be checked out. The district worked to quickly notify parents about the crash, and as the morning went on, several other children were taken to the hospital complaining of minor injuries. There's nothing life threatening with any of the students to, at this time that I know of, but you know, when you're in a wreck two or three days later, they're still going to have headaches and bumps and bruises for a while. The superintendent says the bus driver's been with the district for a long time, and even though she did nothing wrong, she's been shaken up by this deadly crash. From Highland County, Andrew Setters, WLWT News 5.